Hey guys, welcome back to the Nerdy Collector, and today I'm doing a quick video on the Stranger Things Season 2 Second Wave of Pops. Now we've got some glam shots that have been released by Funko of these pops. They will be hitting stores very, very soon. I'm hoping to get my hands on all of these. So I'm just going to run through and show you guys the glam shots of all of these and talk about which ones I'm most excited for. And apologies guys if I do sound a bit blocked up. I am still a little bit under the weather, so sorry about that. So guys, first up here is Eleven. This is the Elevated Eleven. Now this is a, a pop based off the final episode of Season 2, which is really cool. I really like the attire, and I really like the way the blood's coming out of the nose there from both nostrils, not just one. It's just showing you how much power she's actually using, and it's elevated it off the floor and made both her nostrils bleed, and her eyes are all red as well. And um, I really like the Elevation stand. I have got a pop of Falcon, and he does have a stand like that as well. And I really do like those stands. I wish they would use them in more Funko Pops. I believe they'd have just used it in the Iron Man for the Infinity War wave. So that's really cool. And I'm really hoping to pick up this 11 for quite soon. And then, guys, we have Steve with sunglasses. This is another one that I'm really keen on picking up. The other Steve Pop that I got from EMP, which is exclusive here in the UK, it was a Comic-Con's Fall Convention exclusive, I believe. I picked that up with the bat. That is a really cool pop, and now it really goes for quite a lot of money. So it's been nice to pick up another Steve. This is a Steve based off the entire when they go down into the upside down. He's got those rubber gloves on and his big sunglasses. And he is one of the standout characters in Season 2, as you guys well know. And um, it's a really cool looking pop. As I like the fact the bat is strapped to his back, which is really, really cool. And I'm really looking forward to picking up this one as well. And I hope you guys are too. Now, guys, I think this is the pop overall I am most excited for. This is a pop I have been waiting for. This is Bob, the hero of season two of Stranger Things. And it is him wearing scrubs. Now, this is a really, really cool pop. I really like it. Obviously, he's got his headpiece in with his walkie-talkie and his torch. We all know what happens when he leaves that office. This is Bob's first time as a Funko Pop, and I think it's really, really cool that we are getting him. And like I said, I'm looking forward to this one the most out of the wave so far. And um, I cannot wait to put Bob in my Stranger Things collection. We are also getting this pop of Max's brother, Billy. Now, Billy was a new character in Season 2 of Stranger Things, and he's also a first time in the line for a Funko Pop. It's really cool. does portray him really, really well with his leather jacket open with no shirt on, with his jeans on. He is quite a bully. He's not a nice guy, and um, he's going to be a great addition to a Stranger Things collection. I do like the fact in Stranger Things they do make nearly all the main characters Funko Pops, and I'm glad we're getting one of Billy. We are also getting Hopper with vines. Now, this is from a certain scene in season two where Hopper's in the upside down and um, he does get captured by all the vines and things. And obviously, he does get rescued in the end. But um, obviously, this is when he's just stood up and he's all dirty, he's covered and bruises, he's beaten. He is all covered in vines. And um, it's different from the last release we got in the last wave because I just got him in his normal police outfit when they did have a chase version of that as well. But now we're just getting Hopper in Vine, so it's a different sort of look for the character and something I would be interested in picking up uh, when it does become available. And as for variant and exclusive, guys, this picture's quite blown up, but we are getting a variant from Hot Topic of Steve as he's about to go in the upside down, so he's got his goggles and his um, uh, bandana pulled up over his face. This is a really cool pop, it's sort of just a different variant to the one that we're already getting in the general release, but this will only be Hot Topic. For us here in the UK, I imagine Forbidden Planet will pick it up as well. So ForbiddenPlanet.co.uk will probably stock this in the future. And finally, guys, we are getting Bob dressed as a vampire from GameStop. Now, GameStop have probably got the best pop in the whole wave here. This is fantastic. It is just from a funny, hilarious scene in Season 2 where Bob's trying to impress uh, his girlfriend's children by dressing up for Halloween and it's just not working for him. And it's just a really funny moment and I think it's been memed and things like that. So uh, I'm really glad we are getting a pop of this. So GameStop hit the jackpot with this exclusive. So hopefully here we'll get it probably on Forbidden Planet again for the UK. And um, I'm really looking forward to this one. Both Bob Pops are the ones I'm my eye on the most in this whole set. 
So guys, that was just a quick glamour shot look at all the new pops coming from the new season of um, Stranger Things pops. And um, I hope you liked them. I hope you enjoyed this uh, new video and just trying something new. I might start doing this with new waves, just talking about when the glam shots come out. And just let you know what I think, which ones I'm looking forward to most to pick up. And I just want to know what ones you guys are most looking forward to picking up. So let me know in the comments below. I'd really appreciate that. Um, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Links in the description below. Um, tweet me. And post uh, like my photos on Instagram and um, let me know what Stranger Things ones you're looking forward to picking up the most. Don't forget to enter my subscriber competition, 200 subscriber competition. I'm giving away a Chase Porg. Enter that by clicking the link in the description below. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, guys. Most importantly, I do appreciate everyone that does. And if you do subscribe, hit the notification bell so you're aware when my videos pop up. And um, don't forget to hit that like button as well. And I'll see you next time, guys, hopefully for another video like this. Bye-bye.